Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Erica and I'm so glad that you're here for today's video because today we are gonna be trying out some screen prints on a gang sheet for the very first time from our friends at Ninja Transfers. Now, a quick little backstory. I actually started making t-shirts back in like 2018 with just HTV or heat transfer vinyl that I would cut out on my Cricut back there. And then around 2020, I started dabbling in sublimation and doing bleach tees because they were getting more and more popular. Popular. And for those small business owners that have done sublimated teas, you guys know that sublimation can be a little finicky. You have to have the perfect temp and time. You have to sublimate on the right fabric. Otherwise, your design won't come out at all. Your design could even wash out in the washer if you sublimate on the wrong type of fabric also. And don't even get me started on the whole bleaching process and how much time and energy it takes. You have to have like the right water to bleach ratio. You have to be using the right type of bleach and you have to be doing it in the perfect weather conditions otherwise your bleach tees won't turn out so i knew eventually i wanted to veer away from sublimation if i could and with screen prints they take you a fraction of the time to do because you don't have to worry about any of that you can put them on any type of fabric they're very durable and long lasting they don't fade in the wash like sublimation does and i think the quality is just way better in my opinion so since i've tried screen prints before and i knew i genuinely enjoyed the process better than sublimation so i I knew I needed to find a company that I could order all my screen prints from for my small business. So when Ninja Transfers reached out and said they wanted to collaborate and I had already heard amazing things about the company, I was so stoked to try them out. They said they would send me a gang sheet to try out for you guys and to give them an honest review. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. So I just have to say thank you so much Ninja Transfers for reaching out, sending me the gang sheet, letting me do an honest review. I have super high hopes for these screen prints and I cannot wait to try them. And because it's super important important to me. I'm sure it's important to other small business owners out there. I also want to add that I placed my order Tuesday morning and by lunchtime on Thursday, I had already received my gang sheet. So turnaround time and shipping was incredibly fast. That is a huge plus for me. Now, if you are interested in checking out Ninja Transfers for yourself, I will have an affiliate link down in my video description below for you guys. So without further ado, let's go ahead and open up this happy mail and get to pressing these t-shirts. All right, so here here is my order. We are opening this together for the first time. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, you get a cute little holographic ninja sticker. All right, so let's check out what we got. So here is the actual gang sheet. Ooh, and check this out. So they have nice instructions on here. Oh, and they sent these perma stickers. I have never even heard of these. So you get to try out these stickers and it says that they work on any hard surface. So can't wait to try those out, so cool. Definitely love that they sent the instructions because I've ordered screen prints from other companies before and they don't send instructions and then I had to go back to the website and like scrounge around for the instructions. So I really appreciate that. And they also sent some parchment paper to press with your shirt, so love that. And for anyone wondering, this is 22 inches wide and 120 inches long or 10 feet. Oh, I am so excited to look at my designs. And check out my screen prints. I think the quality on these are absolutely amazing. All right, y'all, so I decided not to bore you and I went ahead and cut these out off camera. So now all of my screen prints are separated instead of on that roll so that we can go ahead and press our shirts now. All right, so I'm gonna be pressing my first screen print on a crew neck. So I just lightly pressed it for a second just to kind of preheat the material and get all those wrinkles out. And now we're ready to put on our design. And we're gonna put our piece of parchment paper on top and we're pressing it at 310 for 15 seconds. And these are cold peel transfers, meaning you need to wait like at least 30 seconds before you peel up that carrier transfer sheet. All right, so now that we're done with that, we're gonna put our parchment paper back on and we're gonna press it for an additional 15 seconds now that we don't have that carrier sheet. And 
and voila! Alright y'all, well there you have it. As always, I hope you enjoyed today's video as much as I did. If you did like it, please let me know by giving me a big thumbs up. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to drop a comment down below. I would love to hear what you guys think. And if you're watching this video but you're not already subscribed to my channel, then make sure you click that subscribe button down below so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. I would greatly appreciate the follow. Don't forget to look for my affiliate link down below in my video description if you want to check out Ninja Transfers for yourself and try them out. And a big thank you again to Ninja Transfers for reaching out and sending me a gang sheet to try out. I am absolutely blown away at the quality of these screen prints and I will definitely be ordering all of my screen prints for my small business from you guys in the future. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.